Well, you see it all over college athletics these days. You have to keep up in the financial race. Big money gets the biggest athletes, which usually equals some of the greatest success in sports. Closer to home, Utah State is doing its part to stay relevant in that world of college mm -hmm. athletics. On Friday, the university announced a $125 million fundraising campaign called Reach and Rise, its first ever comprehensive capital campaign. This campaign aims to reach the $125 million goal within five years, money that will help position its 16 varsity programs to find success. Already more than 20 million has been secured through what was called the silent phase of the campaign. We are kicking off a $125 million fundraising campaign for our Department of Athletics, our Reach and Rise campaign. It's the largest in the history of the university and our Department of Athletics. This is opportune time for us to do this, to show our student athletes that our community will continue to give forward to us. Uh, we've had a great cornerstone, but we need to reach and rise higher. Well, I think there's a reason why Utah State Athletics have been so good for a long, long period of time, right, especially men's basketball. You have to have alignment, right? That's really what this is about. You're seeing great alignment from our president uh, and certainly our leader, Diana Sabo. So there's great vision. Uh, this is a top-notch event. Um, you can see how much time and energy and, you know, spirit that's went into this. So uh, happy to be a part of it. Utah State basketball has been to the NCAA tournament three times under three different head coaches recently, just in the past four years. Yeah, you know, for whatever reason, new coaches have come to Logan and they've been able to achieve success quickly, which raises the level of expectations there as well. Now, when Jared Calhoun was introduced this past spring as Utah State's new men's basketball coach, he mentioned in that press conference two words that carry a lot of weight, national championship. He knows the expectation in Logan every year. Uh, even in year one, is to reach the NCAA tournament and advance in the tournament. You know, this is not a rebuild, right? This is a reload. Uh, there's an expectation that's been set. Uh, the goal is to be playing our best basketball March, right, and advancing in the NCAA tournament. They were able to do that last year, beating TCU, falling a little short against Purdue. We can really build off of that, right? We sold that to our recruits, and that's what we want to do with our returning players in this group collectively, uh, play our best basketball. Why not? We got, I mean, I've had four coaches in four years that I've made it to a postseason every year, knock on wood. But, I mean, that's the standard that we have, right? As Utah State, they made to the NIT, and then we made it to March Madness and March Madness. And so that is it's our standard now, that we are going to make it to the postseason. We don't expect anything less, and that's the kind of work that we put forward in the summer that people don't always see, so that we can put a product out there that people will know is worth watching. 